name is Chris Ukhauser, and I play top lane for Georgia Tech. Growing up, I played baseball through elementary school, and then I uh, switched to wrestling in middle school. When I got to high school, I stuck with wrestling for a little bit, and then I ran cross country and track and field. I always kind of liked the sports where it didn't matter what size you were. Video games are definitely an avenue where I can excel. You get gauged on your mental prowess and your dedication. A lot of my friends, uh, elementary, middle school, we would just have sleepovers where we'd play a lot of console games like uh, Super Smash Bros and uh, some of the Halos. And that was a lot of my childhood, just staying up real late, playing games with friends. Probably the oldest game I remember watching my brother play was Age of Empires. I used to just sit and watch him for hours on our old desktop. About the time I started playing League, uh, my brother was getting into college and he wasn't playing as much anymore, so he was uh, turning a bit, a little bit more casual with it. So I was picking up League and I didn't actually play against people. I was only playing against bots until level 15 or so, just because I was scared of getting called a noob. I came into college about silver in ranking, and I played a lot freshman, sophomore year, and by the end of sophomore year, I was diamond one. And so I posted on the Georgia Tech Facebook page looking for a team for the local competition called Game Fest, and uh, got together with some of the guys that are on the team now, and the rest is history. My family's always been supportive. They actually watched the, uh, the shows of me that they've streamed so far, so my niece actually knows about it now too. She's only four. My name is Ava. I love my uncle. Go Yuke! My brother's what instilled video games in me, and he's always supporting me too. So I've had I've got a great group of people around me who want me to succeed, and I want to succeed for them. Oh my gosh, <laughs> we're, we're so just proud. so proud. Yeah, ones that we've watched the tournaments, you know, in the semifinals. We get so excited. We're jumping up and down watching them. You know, we're like keeping up. When's the next one? Who are you playing? It's really exciting. <laughs> this is really neat. My mom uh, texts me a lot of the time before matches, and she texted me the video of the FSU post game analysis, calling me an unstoppable monster. And she thought that was so funny. Yuk, an absolute monster throughout these games. This guy is unstoppable. First time they called him that, I was like, what? And then I was like, yeah! <laughs> my dad's always been super supportive of me. He's always been a big part of my life. He's got a great heart. He's caring, he thinks of others, and he has a lot of balance in his life. We put together a sign that we put in the front yard because we're so proud of Chris and uh, you know what he's accomplished here. We want everybody else to know how hard they've been working, you know, because it's a big deal. It's really, you know, something that we want everybody else to know. Practicing at this level can be pretty mentally taxing, but it's very fulfilling. I've gotten a lot out of this season. I have improved a lot as a player and as a person, just being able to communicate with people and grow as a team like that. I am so happy that he chose to do this, that he's there with his team representing Georgia Tech. Playing against other teams on a national scale has been really cool because there's so many dedicated people that you play against, and you sense that it's more than just league. People have been playing video games their entire life. This year, winning the ULL season, uh, I'd be trying to prove that I spent my time wisely in college. You know, this is my last shot to make something big out of all this. I think it would be great just to show people what I can do.